Libra, this is Kelly from Moon Pie Tarot. Um, so we're going to do a relationship breakup after the breakup spread for the month of October. If you are in separation with someone or from someone at this time, we're going to look at the different energies for all of October um, and see what is going on. Um, if you want to get a personal reading, there's a link in the description box below this video. And um, yeah, let's take a look and see. Relationship breakup for Libra. Libra Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. What does Libra need to know for the month of October? We're going to take a look at what the current energy of this situation, this relationship is. Okay. All right. So, okay. We have the High Priest, which is the Hierophant. So, structure and order. I feel like somebody here you or this person um the current energy is kind of like i'm sticking to my values i'm sticking to my morals i'm sticking to my goal my goals my beliefs that kind of energy okay um this is taurus energy it feels to me like someone is not going to go against the grain someone is not going to go out of their comfort zone or go out of what they believe in and what they think or someone's not going to um, hmm. okay so they're just saying there's something here like someone refuses to just date someone wants commitment okay um, now that could be you, Libra, and I feel like in your, as far as your energy goes, you are not going to settle for less than that, okay? What you believe, doing things by the book, um, you know, it feels to me like it's, it's yes or no, really, for you. And as far as somebody else goes, um, I don't feel like your, this person is against that. But there is an energy of like, maybe it's too rigid or they're not ready. Okay, so what is the root cause of a split or a temporary separation? What is the root cause of any problems in this connection? Okay, taking a long time. <laughs> Somebody doesn't want to wait and I feel like maybe that's you you might be like okay already enough there's there's an energy here the root cause of some kind of split between you and another person is that it's just like going as slow as a turtle it's like come on already can we get this done can we get this moving can we move forward and it really is starting to play out as this is your energy you you want commitment you want to have something strong and stable and valuable and you know secure with someone here and it the problem is that i feel like somebody is just dragging their feet someone is just dragging their feet okay and even though i do feel like this person is all about long-term commitment i feel like the problem is maybe you want this now or you've been waiting a really long time and and you know this is just the the cause of any I want to say split the cause of some type of giving up on the relationship because it's been uh, years and years and years for some of you. Let's take a look and see what this person's true feelings for you, Libra, are right now. Oh, wow. So this person is like super hot to trap for you, Libra. Okay. Fire energy. There's, there's um, earth energy. But this person, like, as far as their feelings go, they're very passionate. You know, like you make them sizzle. Libra they find you very sexy they find you alluring um, they find that you have plenty of drive you can go all night Libra <laughs> I mean this person has like very strong lustful attraction towards you here I see that here and it just kind of feels to me like you know even if there's a split whatever's going on this person is like gung-ho for you 100% still okay um, let's take a look and see what are their intentions towards you right now. What is the, what is your person? What is this person's intentions towards you? I mean, this person just, they have a very strong desire for you. Very like 
If you think somebody's not attracted to you, like get that out of your head because this person's like very hot to trot for you. They think you are the sexiest thing since I don't know what. All right. What are their intentions towards the Libra? Oh, okay. They have good intentions for you. Leo energy here. They have very, and I used to always confuse Libra with Leo. I don't know why. Now, like I know the signs, but whenever I would start a Libra reading, I always say Leo or Leo is always in Libra's reading. Um, very good positive intentions towards you at this time. I mean, like they're very happy. They're very content. They feel like this can be a success, um, but it just feels like they're taking their time to commit or get in a position where it's a done deal to secure, secure the bag. <laughs> you know what I mean? But yeah, I feel like they have very good intentions towards you. Um, let's see. What is the future nature of your relationship? What is the future? Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, I feel like this person really just, they want to, I mean, the page of wands is not like a commitment thing. The future nature of this relationship is like fun, fun and games, having a good time, a lot of texting, crush energy. You know, I don't know, maybe you're dealing with someone who's a bit immature. Um, I feel like some of you might be justified in why there's a split because you want something maybe you're both on two different pages this person's on their own page and that is this let's just have fun you know very enthusiastic and excited to be with you and i feel like the future for this relationship the nature definitely will be a lot of fun with this person um but i don't know the page energy does feel kind of immature <clears throat> okay so Libra, what is the best step for you to take at this time? Oh, okay. So six of cups just flew out. Um, well, I feel like, you know, I feel like this person wants the same thing. It's just that you guys have to get on the same page. I feel like the best step for you to take is, and I'm not saying that you have to, but the message that I'm getting here, spirit is telling you to, reunite with this person and for others maybe like don't let go i feel like things will get better um, if you're able to just give that person if you want to wait for them wait for them you know um if anything if you have children try to spend time with your kids maybe in some ways there might be a message here for some of you is enjoy the playfulness, enjoy the journey. You know, you only have one chance in this lifetime to be happy and that's a decision to make. If you are head over heels for somebody and you want something right now and they're not ready to do that, well, I mean, obviously you have free will and you can do whatever it is that you need to do, but I feel like the message here for you is just overall be playful, have fun, enjoy your time with this person. Um, I do feel they're going to try to reunite with you or have some kind of reconciliation because this person is like head over heels for you. Um, your message here, the best step, let them in, let them in. And of course, like I said, if you're done with the relationship or you don't want to wait anymore, you do what you have to do. Okay. But if you feel like this is your person, like this is your person and there's a chance that maybe you're you know, trying to push the envelope. I mean, listen, I think you have to figure out where you're going to draw lines because if you've been waiting 20 years for someone to commit, you might just have a commitment and you just don't have it labeled and you might already be in that, right? So yeah, personal reading, Libra, reach out to me. And if you're stuck, you don't know what to do, I'll definitely give you a personal reading and let you know how things will go going forward or what is even more clarity on this situation. Okay. So yeah, I'm going to leave that there for you. I hope that gave you some insight and I will speak to you all very soon. Take care.